Ooh, I'm orange. What's up? Ah, next day. Last day. What's up, everyone? So it is actually the last day. Well, this is the night before the last day of California. I'm leaving tomorrow night to go to uh, back to North Carolina. Sadly, I'm actually really liking it here. The weather is always perfect, and it's just is amazing out here. Where I'm at, back home, it's going to be raining 14 days in a row when I get back. So, you know, it's going to be hard making content. And apparently my camera still has not came in. So, I have no idea what I'm going to do after these videos are done. I might have to just go buy a new camera with the paycheck I'm about to get from my job. But I'm about to pack what I have that I need to pack up. So, I don't have to do that tomorrow. I can just enjoy my day tomorrow. So, it's just... I'm going to get a quick little time lapse of me packing. So I just finished packing what I had to pack, uh, and then I got the my skate shoes, my board, and then what I'm gonna wear tomorrow, and then my swimming trunks because I am going to Venice Beach tomorrow. But doing all that makes me actually really sad because now that makes it more real that I gotta go, and I am not ready to go. I am having too much fun out here, and then it's even worse because I have work the day after I come back and it's not a bad schedule 6 a.m. to 2 p.m. enough time to make more videos of course but I'm not gonna be used back to Eastern time so it's gonna be all but I'm gonna be messed up with it but I'm gonna have to get used to it and I am sad that I'm going but I'll come back to you in the morning when I'm on my way to Venice Beach what's up everyone it's the next day and I am actually on my way to Venice Beach now I'm leaving the airport. oh it's still blurry but yeah, so I'm heading to Venice Beach right now because it is my last day here So I'm trying to get off a like, full day in. It's like 10 o'clock in the morning And then after that I'm going to go to head to Westchester Skate Park What's up everyone? We just made it to Venice Beach. It was about a 20 minute skate from where I'm staying at. It's so nice here. I still think I still think Santa Monica Pier is prettier, but it is really nice here. It's peaceful and it's early in the morning. So it's great. I was talking about how Venice Beach sucked. What I meant by what Venice Beach sucked was the skate park here sucked. It, the beach itself is really beautiful. The water is nice. The waves, there's a lot of waves here. It explains why there's a lot of surfers here. I'm not ready to go back to North Carolina. I'm going to be honest because, for one, skating is not accepted as much as it is here. For one, in North Carolina, you can't even skate downtown or the sidewalks just to get by. You have to walk. Unless you have a bike, you know, or a car. So yeah, you can't skate on sidewalks in North Carolina. Here you skate anywhere you want. I mean, if you're skating a spot, of course, you're going to get kicked out. But that being said, it's still accepted a lot. It's more of a, it's accepted as also a, transporta a way to transportate here instead of North Carolina. It's just used as, I guess, disrupting, I don't know. But... And then for two, North Carolina rains constantly. Like it's always raining. Like when I come back, it's raining 14 days in a row. But here, it's every, every day since I've been here, it's looked exactly the same. No, I do maybe a couple clouds, clear skies all day, no rain, and it's beautiful. So of course, California is where it's so at for skating. I mean, I met Mickey Papa and Yuto 
at uh, Westchester, and then I met PJ Ladd at the courthouses. That's sick. I met two, two pros, and I met one AM that should be pro, and then I met Jarrell Ware at Westchester also. I messaged him and asked if he wanted to meet up and stuff, and he was like, "Yeah, man. Let me know if I let me let you, let me get back to you know if I can." And he came out, which was really sick. Me and him had like a two-hour talk, but no. I'm not ready to go back. Like it's, like I'm ready, but I'm not ready. Like I'm ready to see my girlfriend. I'm ready to see my friends and family, but I'm not ready to go back to North Carolina. The weather there sucks. It's always hot. It's always raining. No good parks. We got Fort Bragg, but that's, that park's still kind of not that great either. We got Apex, but that's an hour and a half away from where I live. Come back to you when I get to Westchester. What's up, everyone? I just got to Westchester, and actually, this is my favorite part. I have this is my favorite park I have been to, out of like Stoner, Diamond, Lincoln, and that one uh, Jackie Tatum skate park. Yeah, this is my favorite park, Westchester. It's just so perfect. Everyone's cool here. Let me get as many clips as I can before I have to leave. What's up everyone? So all the clips you just seen me get, those are all I'm gonna get from California. So I am done skating for now because I am just too sore. My sweat my left ankle is I rolled it the first day I got here, but it wasn't completely fully rolled. I was running and I fell on it. And then I guess all the pressure I've been putting on it kind of fully committed with the painful pain I have been feeling and then all the skating I've been doing has been killing my hips. I am just exhausted and I am just too tired to skate so I'm gonna see you guys whenever I update a game which I have no idea will be it could be back when I'm at the airport or it could be back when I'm at the apartment I don't know yet but I'll come back to you guys next time I update what's up everyone I actually just got to the airport past the security and everything so I didn't really do anything else besides lay down the whole day after going to the skate park because I was just too tired, I'm too sore, but I am actually so, 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 so sad that I have to leave here because it's so perfect in Los Angeles. I love it here, but I'm about to go get something to eat because I am hungry. I don't know where at yet. So, follow me on this adventure of me trying to get somewhere, something to eat, fresh Asian flavors. I don't know, if, I'm, that sounds good, but we're gonna look and find somewhere. So I'm thinking my options are pretty small on what I'm gonna go eat. I'm gonna go upstairs and see if I see anything, but I don't think, I, I think upstairs is just like another gate. So I'm not gonna go upstairs to scratch that. I'm not, I'm gonna just go to Starbucks because that's the best option I have because everything else is pretty expensive. Never mind. we're not gonna go to Starbucks because they're closing for construction or something. Of course, my luck, when they want, when I wanna go to Starbucks, they're closed. So I have no idea else where I'm gonna go. I am hungry. So instead of the pizza, I actually just got a cup of noodles from the Chinese place I was talking about earlier. So that was a little quick update, but I gotta wait like two hours before I even board the plane because my plane doesn't come in 
until 11. I don't leave until 11.55, and it's like 9.40, so. So, I found a place, but the charging ports did not work there, so now I have to find another place because so I can charge my phone and my computer so it won't be dead by the time I land. An hour about editing videos, I am exhausted. It's like 10.45, 10.50, somewhere at that time, and my plane still does not take off until an hour after this, but I think we're boarding pretty soon, so I'm going to go check and everything, but I am going to pass out on that plane because I am exhausted. Atlanta, Georgia, 11.55 on time. Make sure I still have a whole, well, I need to be there in like 20 minutes because of boarding, so hopefully that doesn't take too, too long. Either. What's up, everyone? It's actually nighttime where I'm at. I got back this morning and I didn't want to update or anything. I was tired. I didn't really get any sleep until I got to the last airplane I went on. It was 50, it was like a 50 to minute to an hour plane. It was a plane, it was a 50 minute to an hour plane ride back to Raleigh from Atlanta. Yeah, I am back in Fayetteville, North Carolina, sadly. Um, not happy about that, but I mean, there's, I got my girlfriend, I got friends, and I got family here. So, you know, I, like, at least I got some things out here. And I'm going to be pushing for so much more content coming out. I'm going to work my ass off just to work with the content that I want to come out. I'm going to be trying so much harder with different things. California made me realize that I can do a lot more than I, what I have been doing. And it's harder for where I'm at because there's not too much to do here in North Carolina or in Fayetteville. But I am going to find a lot of things to do and I'm going to work and work and work while I have an actual job also so I am gonna work that out I'm gonna keep releasing content not gonna have a schedule I'm gonna get rid of having a schedule and I'm gonna upload at least two videos a week don't know what days but it's gonna be at the same exact time 8 p.m. Eastern time so uh, Western time will be 5 o'clock p.m. but two videos a week maybe three it depends on how I feel with filming I really in California I was in filming I was filming every single day and I really enjoyed it. I I felt like I had a I I felt like I was doing what I wanted to do there and I was filming every single day and skate. And that's what I want to achieve with YouTube. And at the end of the day if I don't achieve making it that's okay with me because I have grown to a passion that I love making YouTube videos. I love releasing content. If I have to work and also do this, I'm okay with that because I am releasing tons of content. And at the end of the day, that's all what matters to me because I have grown to love doing YouTube. And I don't have that big of a following. Of course I don't. I uh, know that's okay with me so far. I mean, I'm going to keep working. I'm not going to give up. And I'm just going to strive for what ever I can go for. I met this one guy at the airport in LAX. He was talking to me. He was from Canada and he was going to become a pro golfer or he was he was going to go to school and his main goal was for go to become a professional golfer. And that's really sick. Anyway, but that's sick that he was going to go strive for his dreams to become a professional golfer. I'm never going to talk to him again, and that's okay, but I do wish the best of luck for him because he is going for his dreams, and that is what the most important thing is in life, is not giving up and give 110% to what you really want. I truly, truly do believe that. If you work your ass off and don't give up, you will eventually get what you want. And I'm going to do that. I'm not going to stop. I'm going to continue releasing content crazy, better content. And I know before the California content, it was pretty much the same type of content constantly. It was a lot of repetitive, and I've been trying to really stop doing that. And California, the California trip made me realize that I can. I can get a... I don't just have to do skating like the little Tokyo video I did not do any skating in that video and I really really enjoyed it I enjoyed editing in that video I want to also become more of a s it's cuz I love scenery I love scenery I love uh, backgrounds I love everything so I'd like to be able to do also that I have a big passion into filming when it comes to stuff like that so stay for the content I hope you guys really really enjoyed the 
California trip I had. These are the nine days that are up. Sadly, it is over. I am back to real life. I'm going to go to California again very soon, though, so I cannot wait to go to do that. But stay tuned. Like, comment, subscribe, guys, whenever next time I post.